everyone, my name is Colleen Peters and I am the Director of Education here at Ripley Waterfowl Conservancy. I'm really excited today because we are doing another Species Spotlight video and as you can see in the background, uh, I am here with our trumpeter swans. So we have a pair of trumpeter swans that have been at the Conservancy for many years. So if you visited us, you've probably seen these guys before. Now the trumpeter swan is one of my favorite species because it is one of the largest species of waterfowl in the world. Um, these guys can reach up to about 25 pounds in weight. Um, but because of their large size, they have a difficult time kind of getting up and go to fly away. Um, so when they're ready to take flight, they need a runway of about 100 meters on the water um, to really be able to get them the lift that they need to fly. Now the trumpeter swan has a wonderful conservation story because it's one of success. And as we know so many times, um, we don't have successful endings for species that are threatened or endangered in the wild. So the trumpeter swan became critically endangered due, primarily due to overhunting and then the utilization of different parts of this bird uh, for the fashion industry. Um, long feathers were also used for quills. And that we had significant conservation effort put in place here in the United States. And in the early 2000s, this species was listed as a species of least concern. So we're no longer worried about it becoming uh, critically endangered or endangered in the foreseeable future. Now today, if you wanted to see this species in the wild, um, you could perhaps see them in the Midwestern or Northwestern United States or up into Canada. Um, if you are not able to travel to those places, then come on by to Ripley and you can see our pair here in Northwest Connecticut.